Hi everybody, this is a quick speed comparison between the C-Flow fans and the TMC blowers. Uh, the TMC reports that it's uh, 230 CFM and the C-Flow reports that it's 270 CFM. Although through my testing I found that the TMC is considerably faster. So in this test I have my fans hooked up to battery running at 12.7 uh, volts so if you're running off a power supply then it will be a little bit slower but the difference will still be the same. Um, I'll be testing the difference with my anemometer um, and you'll see that the TMC is about 12k an hour faster usually um, and I'll be using iRacing Fanboy to control it. So what I'll go ahead and do is I will switch them on to full speed and then I'll hold my anemometer up and you'll be able to see the difference. So there we can see we're getting about 80, close to 80 on the TMC and we're getting mid 60s on the C-Flow. Now the TMC does draw more amps, it's a 10 amp fan, whereas the C-Flow is a 6 amp fan, so it does push the Monster Motos a lot harder. So I found that they would overheat if I didn't run active cooling. So what I've done is designed my new case, which has a 50 millimeter fan built into the case, and that keeps it down to about 32 degrees, uh, no matter how fast the fans are going. I've got the fan hooked up to the fan number A, so it will ramp up with the speed of the main blowers. So the faster you go, the faster the cooling fan will go and it keeps it at 32 degrees no matter what you do. Um, so yeah, these TMCs are faster but they're a lot harder to run. I uh, can't guarantee they'll run perfectly because you're pushing the um, Monster Moto a lot harder almost to its limit. They're capable of 14 amp continuous so it should be able to handle a 10 amp load but you're definitely going to cause a lot of heat and without a heat sinking fan then you're going to run into trouble. Uh, but there, are, there is some a lot faster speed on the TMC. Hope this is helpful. See ya.